What's up, P Nation? Today we are on the hunt to find the best beaches around LA. We have a lot of driving. Let's go. All right, and we've made it to our first stop. Laguna Beach apparently has 30 beaches, and we chose to go to Victoria Beach, which has Pirate Tower, which I don't even know if we can get in, but we're just gonna try and see. Look at these houses, honestly. What is this? The tide is super high. It's actually the highest it's gonna be all day. And so behind us, that's where we could walk around to get to the Pirate Tower. But as you can see, the tide's super high and unless we're trying to swim. It's not gonna happen today, yeah. but that's okay. <laughs> it's so funny that like, it's true. So Laguna Beach has 30 beaches. And when we were kind of planning this day of like trying to find the best beaches around LA, I was like, yeah, Laguna Beach. Like, we should go to Laguna Beach. And Zach was like, what, which beach? I was like, no, which Laguna one? Beach. Which one? And so I had to, like, realize that there are so many beaches around Laguna Beach. Laguna Beach is a city on the water. On the cliffs. It's breathtaking. <laughs> yeah. Each beach has its own cliff little community, and it's just absolutely stunning. The houses here are gorgeous. Yes. And we're technically in OC County, but you just need to know there are more than one beach at Laguna Beach. This one is pretty pristine. There's no one here right now, which is kind of like a beach that I like. Yes. It's kind of a bummer that we can't get to this like pirate's lookout, but this is what it supposedly looks like. And we wish we could have seen it, but this beach is awesome anyway, so on to the next one. All right, now it's time to walk up this huge hill and go to our next beach. I think it's Newport? Newport Beach, which is in Newport Beach. So it's not complicated. <laughs> it's the only one, it's not 30. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> We have made it to Newport Beach, and this is a really, really family-friendly beach. I've never seen so many kids having fun surfing, swimming, playing with toys on the beach. Like, I didn't realize school was out on Thursday in January, but apparently it is. Right. There's so many more people here in Newport Beach just because the beach is so much wider. Like, mm -hmm. you can fit a lot more people. Mm -hmm. And I think just, like, beach access in general is a little bit easier, but they have an amazing pier. There's so many people fishing out here right now. The water is perfect. It is so blue. You can see Catalina Island. It's right behind us. Like, oh it my god! It is gosh. seriously so clear today too. And you oh can my see gosh. all the freighters going to Long Beach. Like, this is. <laughs> I like Newport Beach a lot. We're walking in a dream. And there's like little kids learning how to surf behind me, and it's so funny because as soon as one gets up, like the entire pier goes crazy because it's like, oh my gosh, you just learned how to surf. <laughs> So on a map, Newport Beach is kind of like, it feels like it's hard to get to because there's so many marinas blocking it from like Highway 1. But it makes it really cool to be here just because like you can see the beach right there. And then right behind us is literally the marina with like all of these crazy sailboats and like a playground and people who live here. And it's just like, it feels so small. Like it's the beach is right there and the marina is right here and there's just water everywhere and there's just like this crazy sailboat culture and just it's really really cool but next beach is Huntington Beach which everybody gives well okay Caroline was giving me a lot of crap because I was like Huntington but I guess you're supposed to say Huntington that's how you do it, it all Huntington runs together beach. and I think we're gonna grab lunch there but really I just brought us a picnic We made it to 
Huntington Beach. I said it right this time. Huntington <laughs> Beach. And I love this place because I actually spent a 4th of July here and we parked in the neighborhood and everyone had their doors open and it was like such a community. And it really gave me the first glimpse of like what beach life in California, in my opinion, is all about. And yeah. I love it. But we just pulled up here today and realized there's like oil rigs in yeah. the neighborhood, which is so interesting to see. I come from Texas, the state of oil. And we don't even have oil rigs this close to houses. Like it's kind of crazy yeah, that they're right on the beach. Right near the water. There is like an oddly like industrial feel to this city or this town. Cause you, al you also have the oil rigs that are out beyond the water. Yeah, so it's like you're kind of like surrounded by industry even industry. if you're on the beach or mm -hmm. if like you're in the town. So as far as like visiting goes, I don't know if this is like would be a beach that I would choose. I love it. If you can rent a beach house here and truly be in the neighborhood, like unmatched, unmatched. <laughs> We brought a lunch. I made salads. And we have clementines and Cheez-Its. And we're like beneath the shade of the pier. And this is like a serious pier. It's made of concrete. We're so used to seeing ones of like, what is it, logs, wood. This one is super serious. There are a lot of people here. It's not all a state park. So there's a portion where Huntington, the city of Huntington, owns the beach, so it's like city beach. It's so clear, the last time I was here, like a huge thing of like smog mixed with fog rolled through and actually like blocked out the sun. So that is possible when you come here. But now that we're sitting down and we're like out of the heat, it's actually really nice. We've been really into wholesome food ever since we got to California. We're trying to like match the vibe here. We're not doing vegan or vegetarian. It's just like lots of fresh ingredients and Leah actually made this cracker. This pier is awesome. This is actually my favorite pier we've been to today, which we've only been to two so far. But there are so many surfers on either side of this pier and these waves are really big. So it's like pulling in pretty good ones and actually some amateur ones too. We've seen a lot of people crash, which has been a lot of fun. But now that I had lunch, I actually like this place more, which I think speaks more about me than Huntington. <laughs> yeah, I really like it. And I, it would be really cool to be here for 4th of July. I'm really jealous that you got to have that experience. One day. Yeah. One day. This is my favorite beach so far. Oh really? But the next one, I've been so many times, it's gonna be so hard to compete. It's the one that surprises everyone when we take them there. It's Manhattan Beach. Oh yeah, that's true. Oh, I do love Manhattan so fun. Beach. Alright, we're gonna head up the coast on Highway 1, California 1, to our favorite beach, Manhattan. Let's go! Shh. This portion of Huntington is, I know, look at them, look at that what baby. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there's like a portion where the, for you guys. the houses stop and there's like, I don't know, like okay. it's it's very Close. related to the oil industry because there's a rig like directly across from the beach. And it's, so the beach there is a dog park and it is the cutest place to be. Like, we just saw the cutest dogs go by. <laughs> There's a corgi outside of that car, too. I like little things, so corgis are way up there on my list. And English bulldogs. French bulldogs. So <laughs> funny. It's great, but it's like, it's an unfavorable spot on the beach because it's like, got oil over here and oil over there. I'll take dogs all day. I, know. I don't even care. I, I feel like we should have showed you guys this. We're kind of running out of daylight, so. Yeah, it is January. <laughs> on to Manhattan Beach. right here is the main reason why this place is so cool. There's bikers, yeah. there's walkers, there's houses to look at. You have more room. We're on an elevated platform so you can really see the ocean. It's beautiful. 
beautiful. They have a really cool pier as well. It's not giving me like the same energy as Huntington Beach Pier. Yeah, well, that's Surf City USA. So there are some surfers here, but True. not as many. I mean, Huntington had thousands, so many, yeah. like honestly. I feel like Manhattan Beach is the perfect place to actually relax. Yes. You know, like if you're coming to a beach to relax on, like this is it. Cause like there are people on it, but it's not crazy, crazy crowded. And I think if people don't like consider it because the airport is so close by, like they're mm. gonna think it's not as nice. Yeah, That's and Santa Monica is right up the road, which is yeah. a great beach and we'll have a, our own video about that like later. But yeah. Manhattan is truly our favorite. And this is technically the only beach we visited today in LA County. So it's closest to LA also. Yes. It just, I don't know you guys, it wins. So I realized I came into this like beach hunt a little biased because I've already been here at Manhattan Beach but I think my opinion still holds true Manhattan Beach really is like the winner for all the for the four beaches we went to it just like has everything you need to have like a lot of fun at the beach which makes it the best like it has really good bathrooms it has a really good beach it has all the surfers it has really good waves it has a really cool beach town and like a really cute little downtown area which we haven't shown you but it's really awesome and it's like totally worth going to so manhattan beach wins all right and that is it it is the best manhattan beach wins we didn't go to santa monica but like we said click on that video I'll insert it up here and thank you <laughs> because this day was awesome. I didn't know that we could hit all these beaches in such a short amount of time, but we did it yeah. all in one day. It really was one day. We didn't cheat any corners. No cheating. <laughs> all beaches, all LA. Thanks for watching. All right, we have made it to Laguna Beach. All right, we have made it to Newport Beach. Whew, and that is it from Laguna Beach. It's getting hot. We need to- Newport, we're in Newport. Oh.